In this short tutorial, I'm going to show you how to install FSX onto Windows 10. First of all, have a look at your computer specifications to make sure it is capable of running FSX. Step 2. Install FSX by inserting the disk into your computer and, when you get the option, hit Install Flight Simulator X. Step 3. Once the directory has been chosen or selected manually, FSX will then begin to install onto your PC. Step 4. Once prompted, install FSX Disk 2 and hit OK. Step 5. Once FSX has completed installing, you'll be asked to accept the FSX User License Agreement. Once you have read the agreement, hit Accept. Step 6. You will then be asked if you wish to activate your version of FSX now or later. Hit Activate Now. Step 7. You will then be prompted to enter your 25 character product key in order to activate FSX. This product key can be found in the box that you purchased FSX. Step 8. Allow FSX to verify your product key. This may take a minute. Once your product key has been activated, hit finish and FSX will begin to boot up. And finally, step 10. Once FSX has booted up, you will be taken by default to the home page. Scroll down and click free flight. You will then be shown a tri ultralight or a microlight, and by default, this will take you to Friday Harbour. Hit fly now for a quick flight. And that is FSX all installed. Some programs that you install you may want to run as administrator. I hope this tutorial has helped you to install FSX onto Windows 10. If you would like a tutorial on anything else regarding Flight Simulator X and Windows 10, please comment below. Don't forget, like, comment and subscription would be fantastic. Thanks for watching, have a good day.